Canu Canines has partnered with seven different prisons and the puppies come and stay for one full year and the inmates are in charge of raising and training those dogs to be service dogs. Yeah, yes, good, good boy. boy. Yes. The best part is that they can really put that focus and energy into the dog 24 seven. So the beauty of that is the dogs can just move through the training program that much faster and have some more stimulation and you know, they get lots more belly rubs, lots more cuddle time. We have one inmate handler in particular, Mark, that is an extremely patient and caring dog handler that worked in the program and trained dogs for us. And one of those dogs was Liam. Liam! Come! Yes! Good boy! Good job! Our inmate handlers, what they're working towards with these dogs is that they want to get them to graduation. Graduation is all about our volunteers being able to walk up on stage and hand that leash over of the dog they've been raising and hand it over to the client to signify that, you know, the dog's moved on and is now working with their client. And because Mark wasn't able to be there to do that for the ceremony, he ended up writing a letter for Liam for his graduation. Liam, my dear friend. Wow, look at you, partner. The day we always talked about has finally come. You made it. I could not be more proud of you. As you embark on your new adventure of enriching the life of another, I want to thank you for enriching mine along the way, for teaching me to persevere for the sake of someone else when things got tough and I wanted to run, for helping me to consider the bigger picture and not just the one right in front of me, for teaching me that life is much better lived when it's made more about others and less about self, for giving me a clearer picture of loyalty, trust, and unconditional love, for showing me that I have value, that I have something to contribute, and that I am capable for caring for another living being, for never holding a grudge when I made a mistake or wouldn't put peanut butter in your Kong. <laughs> And last but definitely not least, for giving me a reason to believe in myself and my family a reason to be proud of me. It's absolutely incredible to be part of the prison programs. I get to see these inmates really truly grow and change, not just in their dog training skills, but in their people skills that they can use when they get out one day. And they get the unconditional love of a dog again. But you've got a job ahead now and a, new, and a new life to impact. This is what you've prepared for, and I have every confidence in you. Okay, get the brush. Thank you. I have no doubt you'll never work a day in your life, as I know you're going to really love your job. It's simply who you are. Thank you, sweetheart. Go close it. It's been such a joy to be a part of your journey. You've taught me at least as much as I ever taught you. And I am honored to have had you at my heel and at my side. And I'm incredibly blessed to have had a Sally as cool as you. And even though I'm still finding your hair and all my stuff, you'll always have a place on the great mat in my heart. So go forth, boy, fight the good fight, and continue to make a difference all of your days. I'll always remember my furry friend, Daddy Mark. Ah, <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah, so, yeah, he's a special boy.